Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to do a birthday haul. So it was my birthday, it's actually nearly a month ago. My birthday was on the 10th of March, but I've just got around to filming this because work has been crazy, like I said in my other video. So I just filmed a video using the new Naked Reloaded palette. So if you want to see how I got this look, then I'll put a link above in a little card so you can click on that. This was one of the birthday presents so I thought we'd try it out. The gifts that Ryan gave me didn't come until the other day actually so I have been putting off filming this so that I could include everything and then my mum also said she found a little gift that she meant to give to me but she has just found it in her drawer. This always happens at like Christmas later on. My mum will find end up finding little bits and bobs that she meant to give me for birthdays and Christmas so I don't know what it is yet but I will just thought I'd film the video anyway because time's getting on. I just put all all my gifts in this bag. It's not full. One of the presents was quite big so I put everything in there. I actually forgot to bring it upstairs but I'll include a picture here. It's my mother-in-law gave me cushion with a rabbit on it and I thought it was really cute so it's downstairs in the living room just now and I forgot to bring it up but anyway I'll just do this in order of people that gave me the gifts so since I started off with my mother-in-law she also got me the Naked Reloaded palette I asked for it for my birthday and it's just just looks like that it's really nice and if you want to see pictures or how I did the makeup look I'm going to leave links down below. My mother-in-law also got me this little purse. She made sure that it wasn't leather since I am vegan. Okay I've cut the tag off so it's just this little navy glitter purse from the brand Fiorelli. I think this is from Debenhams and it just looks like that. She put a little pound in it for good luck. I think this would be really good actually for um, Ryan's sisters getting married in July and my outfit's navy so I think that would match really well actually. I need to keep that in mind. So that little purse was a nice gift. Next I will do what my sister-in-laws gave me. It was Ryan's sister and her partner. It's just in this little bag and also she bought me this. So I'll start off with the Urban Decay thing. So this is I've never seen this before actually. It's the Urban Decay Naked Illuminated. So I think it's just like a highlighter. It comes in this gorgeous box and then it's like a dome shaped highlighter. It's really nice and it's like the perfect gold highlighter shade. It also comes with a little brush which I thought was nice if you're ever travelling with it. So as some of you will know, I've been vegan for, I think it's coming up for three years this month. One of my sisters-in-law did um, Veganuary and she's just trying to eat more plant-based, I think. So she kind of knew of the different places to get good vegan chocolate and sweets. So they got me a dark chocolate raspberry Cho milk chocolate honeycomb and dark chocolate with orange and ginger pieces and I think I've my mother-in-law got me that one for Christmas and it was really nice so I'm sure the other ones will be beautiful I'm excited to try them next is a little raw chocolate brownie I've been waiting to film this video so that I can finally eat these so I'm excited that's what that looks like I think that'll be really tasty. The last thing they got me is these dark chocolate peanut butter mini eggs. I've never actually seen this before so I'm excited to try it. Just looks like that. I love the design on it as well. I think they are like mini eggs but chocolate. Like chocolate covered. My two grannies got me money which was really helpful. That's put in my bank. My mum gave me money. She also got me a bottle of rhubarb gin, which is downstairs. Uh, what else? My birthday cake, which I will insert a picture of here. The mystery gift that I don't know about. And then I also asked for 
a pair of the, I think they're called Lift Converse, they're the chunky platform, I'll go and get them. So this is what they look like, they are a lot chunkier than the normal Converse and I really like them, they're so comfortable. And this is coming from someone that gets blisters in every new pair of shoes that I ever wear. But these are really comfy, so yeah. Got them. Last but not least, I will show you what Ryan got me. I had asked for headphones, I just wanted a little cheap pair. And then he went to get me Beats headphones, but they were like £300 and I said there's no way. I just wanted a little cheap pair. He still went out and bought these, which are really decent headphones. So I'm sure they'll last a while. They are just these white headphones. They are the brand JBL and they are wireless, which is great for when I'm going to the gym. And they're really comfy. I think my head, like from my ears to the top of my head are quite small because they need to be on the lowest extended thing. I had that the wrong way around. Does anyone else have to wear, have to check the right and left before they wear headphones? I just really don't like wearing them if they're not the right way around and these have the initials there which are very helpful and that's what they look like they're meant to be noise cancelling so I have been wearing these to the gym and I've only needed to charge them once and I've used them for like three weeks so that's really good and then that was all he got me on my actual birthday because two gifts were stuck in um, America and then we had to pay customs or he had to pay customs fees and so it took forever to come but I'm happy that it eventually did come and uh, just in time for the video so he got me this candle from Forever Wick and he thought it would be funny to get it in the scent unicorn poop that's what it looks like and these are one of those candles that have a ring no a diamond inside we've notice that there's a mark here which I'm assuming is where the diamond is so I'll need to wait and burn it down until I can get it out and then see what it looks like. It says it burns for 70 hours. It might be a while before I get to see what the diamond looks like. He also got me a bath bomb which was the same idea that it had a ring inside. I'll show you the ring, it's really funny. So I'll put over the screen what they tell you all the rings look like and stuff like that and then when I opened the bath bomb well first of all I thought it was going to be inside the bath bomb so I put it in the bath and I was waiting and waiting and waiting waiting on this ring to appear turns out it was in the box sitting itself so I thought the whole point was that it was inside the bath bomb so I looked like an idiot in the bath waiting on this ring appearing once I found it in the box this is what it looks like. How mad is that? It's huge. I think it'd be quite nice with costume jewellery but Ryan and I were laughing at just how kind of like, I don't know, it just isn't what we thought it would be. But it's still a good idea. Maybe I could wear it as costume jewellery. So yeah. At least it fits though. It'd be worse if the ring didn't even fit. I think that's everything. I had a really nice birthday as you will have seen in my March vlog. It was just me, my mum, dad, Ryan and my two grannies and we went to Frankie and Benny's for lunch and then we had some cake at my mum's afterwards and it was really nice just to spend time with family. I hope you guys enjoyed watching what I got for my birthday. If you did enjoy it please give it a thumbs up and thank you so much for everybody that has subscribed so far. I think we're on 135 subscribers so thank you so much to each and every one of you I really really appreciate it and I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye! Not a soul.